Thanks, Mayor. Just notice a few few faces out there. I, I assure you this is no joke, so if you have to laugh, go out in the hall and laugh. I'm serious about that. Be, understand this is serious now, okay? I want to congratulate you for making it this far. Very, very true to that. It takes a lot just to get here. A lot of candidates went through this particular selection process. There was something that we saw in each one of you that made us think that you're ready or prepared to start learning to be a Omaha police officer. So you demonstrated some level of success to us while you're here. Enjoy this academy. You will remember it the rest of your life. It's going to be stressful. It's going to be stressful physically, mentally, and emotionally. It's designed to do that. We have to test you in all three of those facets. Because in this job, you're going to see some things. You're going to see some things that are very messy. You're going to see some horrible things. So we have to make sure that when you witness what you witness, it's not going to mess you up up here. You're able to do it physically, and you're able to do it mentally. So the staff that you see to the, on both sides of you, they're aces. They really are. They're the best of the best. You couldn't ask for a better training staff than they are. They're going to come at you with very different styles, but all with your best interests at heart. We want you to make it through this. An Omaha police career is, is very special. You have an opportunity to work and serve in what I think is the greatest city in this country. You take any city, our population, and I've traveled around, I would not want to live anywhere other than Omaha. You'll feel the city's respect, you'll feel the city's support. That is why starting now, you have to carry yourselves very professional and very humble because law enforcement and police work, especially in the city of Omaha, carries with it an extreme amount of power. This isn't your entry level job anywhere else. When you leave this academy, you're gonna have the authority and the power and the duty to deprive somebody of their liberty if they break the law. You legally have the duty and the power to utilize lethal force, other types of force, if you need to during the course of your business to protect society, to protect yourself. That's an awesome responsibility. So that is why what I ask for is you put your heart and soul into this academy, you carry yourselves professionally, when you leave this academy as well, because now your neighbors are gonna have just a little bit of an asterisk by your name. That is no longer so-and-so that lives next to me. That's so-and-so that's a police officer. And it's more of an asterisk to me because that's so-and-so who's an Omaha police officer. All right, I didn't mean to come in here and, and lecture, and I didn't wanna come across as hard. This is a great moment for everybody in here. I look forward to hearing the progress of this particular class. It's the largest class we've ever put on. And I can tell you right now, collectively as a group, you look pretty good. I can't wait to stand up here in four months and see everybody in uniform because generally you look twice as good then.